Someone. Oh, sh. I just built this thing. Damn it. This is what we can call like a satisfying drift car game. This is really good. I love it. What's up everyone, I was Zap, in a new video, we are back again with BeamNG. Today guys, we have a new mod that we're gonna try it out. By the way, did you see the new future? You can open the hood. I'm clicking with the left mouse button, but it doesn't work. Wait a second, it should work. Maybe we can open the trunk, let me try it. Oh yeah, we can open the trunk, but I can't open the hood. Anyways, let's get in the car and continue talking. Wait a second, we have like a hood release right here, let me click it. Yeah, that does make sense. Let me now open it, you can see the engine and everything. That is dope as hell. Okay, let me close the hood click it this is not my car but i got it from my friend and the bad thing about this car it is automatic hashtag save the manual today guys we're gonna be testing a new drift car and if you have a wheel setup you're gonna like it a lot so make sure to watch this video till the end for today's plan we're gonna rescue a car and as you can see there is like a bumper right there and that's the car that we're gonna rescue and make it proper drift car let's reverse and align it with the trailer i really hate like reversing with the trailer by the way but we forgot that we need like space so we can drop the trailer go forward and now we press O so we can drop it. And she is going down. Let's leave it in parking mod. Okay, we're good. Let's activate this thing. This is the BMW 3 Series BMW E46 sedan, 330i. And as you can see from the left side, it looks good. But I think from the right side, it is not good at all. Look at the wheel. I don't think that we can drive it like that. The right side, it is totally smashed and it has really shitty rims. We gotta change it too. But overall, we can fix it. It's not fully totaled. And let me tell you a story what happened to this car. Basically, the owner of this car, after he got the E46, first First thing he did, he welded the diff and after that he thought like he's a good drifter and he went for a couple of slides and it went good. Maybe the first corner it went good, maybe the second one, maybe the third one. After he did enjoy a couple of slides there is something bad happened. He did lose the control and crushed the car in the barrier. After the crush he did push the car outside the road and he left it stranded. And it's my time to revive this car and give it a good story. And that's it for the story and let's see if we can start the car. Okay here goes nothing. I think the engine is in good condition. Let's try to put it in first gear. Let's see. Ooh. <laughs> but we got it on the trailer. That's a good thing. I'm done with the picture and let's take this thing to the garage. Oh, this is really sketchy and we have to make like a big turn. There's like a squeak noises and the wheel like acts really weird right now. Okay, that was good. By the way, guys, I'm gonna leave the link for this BMW E46 in the description. So make sure to download it from there. And if you wanna buy any Moza Racing products, you can use my affiliate link in the description. Trust me, the Moza R5 bundle, it makes like the drifting much easier. We made it to the repair auto shop and let's leave the car right here. Now we're gonna drop the trailer again. Look at this thing, she's holding. Let's put this thing inside of the garage. Man, I can't drive this thing. She's going sideways. But the steering wheel, it does act really Really weird right now super aggressive this is annoying but okay we're gonna stop it right here the only bad thing about this game when you change the part like it fixes the car automatically okay it's not a big deal so the first thing we're gonna do is changing the differential if you have an open diff you need to make it like welded and for the radiator we're gonna change it to ultra high performance radiator if you're gonna push the car to the limit you need to have a better radiator for the steering we're gonna put the quick ratio drift steering I'm gonna change the exhaust and we're gonna make this thing a little bit louder let's put the race exhaust for the engine management we're gonna change to sport ECU. For the struts we're gonna keep them like that. For the struts you can use the sock one or the race one. Let's get to the engine. We're gonna change the engine long block and we're gonna put it like ultra heavy duty. For the engine mounts it's gonna be the same thing ultra heavy duty. For the oil pan we're gonna change it to race one and the flywheel we're gonna put the ultra light flywheel and now we can change the intake to something better because now we got better cooling system and better engine block. We're gonna put the stage 3 variable boost turbocharger. For the transmission we're gonna put like the race 6 speed manual transmission. And the last thing for the front bumper support, we're gonna add the oil cooler. That's it for the parts and let's get to the tuning. I do like high force feedback so we're gonna max this thing out. For the transmission we're gonna start with the third gear. We're gonna put it 1.9, fourth gear 1.64, fifth gear 1.3 and the last gear we're gonna put it to 1. For the wheel alignment we're gonna change the caster to max and we're gonna change the wheel offset so we can make it a little bit aggressive. We're gonna apply the changes and make sure to save the setup. And the last thing we're gonna do, we're gonna change the rims and the color of the car and let's see how it's gonna look like. A new day and there is a police already in the shop. I think he knows what I'm about to do right now. It definitely looks a lot better and aggressive, especially in the front. The other front bumper, I don't like it. And the police is already waiting for me to do something. These wheels, I already found them in the shop and I had to slap them on the E46. You know what time it is? It's time for sliding. It sounds a lot better. I hope the cops does like that. <laughs> I don't know if I can slide right here without getting caught. Let's see. 
No, never mind. Okay, now we have to escape the police somehow. I'm going this way. The FPS like is going a little bit down. I can feel it. It's not smooth. Someone told me that I need. Oh shit! Someone. Oh sh! I just built this thing. Damn it! Okay, he's blocking my way. Damn, bro. Police has no chill at the moment. Let's see if we can escape the police, man. I don't think that we can do that. Oh, there is traffic in common. Oh, that was super close. I'm going this way. Never mind. Oh, let's go to the right. Hey, they definitely can catch me. And I swear to God that I have no clue what happened to the mirrors. They got a little bit glitchy. I really hate that. Hello, Popo. That's good. I'm just enjoying this BMW E46. And this uphill. Yeah, it does feel really good. I'm in love with it. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> he did crush. What a crazy guy. Oh, sh <laughs> I totally recommend you to try to drift this car with a steering wheel. It is so good. Okay, now I don't know where I'm going. Maybe this way. Ooh. Not the tree. By the way, can someone tell me how to fix this mirror issue? If you know how to fix them, just let me know in the comments. I'll be so happy. Okay, they're waiting for me to finish the sides. I'm out. You can chase me. Now we are going to a narrow road, as you can see. Ooh. <laughs> there is something bad happened, and I have to be mad about it. My second monitor, it went off, and my computer did froze. That was really, really annoying. The police is chasing someone, and it's not me. What the hell? Anyways, let's get back to drifting. And we got the rear bumper back. Hope we don't lose it. Ooh, this is a sketchy road. Oh. Never mind. That moment it felt like a deja vu. Oh, they are chasing me now. I have to wait for this guy to move so we can drift that section. Okay, I think they're gonna ram me. <laughs> I have to go. Ooh, that was super close. Oh, that's an undercover cop. I didn't see him. What the hell? Okay, this is so sketchy because we got some traffic in the way. And I hope we don't crush. Ooh, okay. Oh, he's literally behind me. Oh, no, he did ram me. No, 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 no. That's not good. Not easy to drift with the traffic. We have, like, limited space. Oh, someone did crush right here. Come on, man, move. Move, bitch. Get out of the way. This reminds me of my country roads, you know. <laughs> But this is a fun section, like a 2K. Sheesh! Living here. Oh no, don't stop in the middle of the road. Damn, bro. We gotta try this section without the traffic. That's gonna be sick. Oh, that was clean overtake. This time we did remove the traffic and let's see what we can do. Getting a little bit closer. That was insane, I can tell you. I'm sweating. <laughs> I'm sweating. This is what we can call like a satisfying drift car game. This is really good. I love it. Okay, break, break, break. Police are waiting for me right there. Ooh. Oh no, there is a roadblock. It looks like it. I'm going this way. Ooh. Another car. No, they're not gonna stop me. Yeah, boy. Can we get between them? Ooh, that was a tiny gap. Oh, that's the end. We're going this way. Reverse entry. Ooh. Okay, this guy is trying to make a roadblock. I'm going this way. Thank you. Oh, they're trying like to catch me, man. They're trying. Oh, no, no. <laughs> no, 
<laughs> not today, officer. Not today. Woo. Oh, no, no, no. What happened? Oh, man. That's it for today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to smash that like button, share this with your friends. Also, comment, don't forget to subscribe and hit the button so you don't miss out anything. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Peace.